What a mood of celebration here in the nation's capital. So many hundreds of thousands of people turning out this weekend to celebrate this inauguration, all a part of the lead up to today's big public swearing in and, of course, the parade to follow. Take a look. Overnight, the president attended the first event of his second term, a candlelight reception. What we're doing is celebrating each other and celebrating this incredible nation that we call home. Where he addressed the issue everyone in Washington has been discussing. I love Michelle Obama. To address uh, the most significant event of this weekend, I love her banks. Hours earlier at the White House, his second term officially began as the president took the oath of office in a private White House ceremony. So help me God. As Michelle and daughter Malia beamed, 11-year-old daughter Sasha encouraged her dad. You did the job, Daddy. I did it. You didn't mess up. Today, the real festivities begin. All weekend, workers have been preparing the Capitol, the National Mall, and the parade route for the influx of spectators who've descended upon Washington to watch Obama be sworn in a second time. The theme of this year's inauguration is uh, our people, our future. And while the president plans to look to the future, he'll also pay tribute to the past. He'll be sworn in on two Bibles, one used by Abraham Lincoln and one. Fittingly, on this day, used by Martin Luther King Jr. The president will celebrate at only two inaugural balls versus the ten held four years ago. Even if there is less fanfare, the day will not be without its pomp and circumstance and fair share of star power. Katy Perry kicked things off at a concert earlier this weekend. Beyonce, whose rendition of Etta James's At Last was a highlight of the 2009 inauguration, will this time perform the national anthem at the Capitol ceremony. And who can forget that moment in 2009? George, again, as Sasha adroitly pointed out, Dad did not mess it up. He has one not more shot at it. Around. That's exactly right.